Hi, I'm comedian and actor Darren Marlar, and I'd like to talk to you about something really close to me. This time of year, the holidays, Christmas time specifically, we all have a tendency to be concerned about what we're going to eat, which is really kind of stupid because of any time of the year for us not to be concerned about what we eat, now would be the time, right? So let's throw all caution to the wind and let's really treat the holidays the way they are intended to be treated. And to help you out, I've come up with the Darren Marlar Holiday Eating Plan. It's an eight-step plan, and here's how it works. First, carrot sticks. Avoid those. I mean, anybody who puts carrots on a holiday buffet table, they don't know jack about Christmas. If you see carrots on the buffet table, leave immediately. Go next door where they have carrot cake instead. Number two, eggnog. Drink as much as you can, and quickly. Like anything else worth having, it's rare. In fact, it's even more rare than diamonds. You can't find eggnog any other time of the year except now. So drink up. Who cares if it has 10,000 calories a sip? <laughs> Number three, if something has gravy, use it. That's the whole point of gravy. Gravy doesn't stand alone. Pour it on. Make a volcano out of your mashed potatoes. Throw the gravy in. Eat it up. Repeat the process. Oh, and speaking of those mashed potatoes, number four on the list, ask if those potatoes are made with whole milk or skim milk. If it's skim milk, pass. That's stupid. That's like buying a sports car with an automatic transmission. Number five, don't eat something before going to someone's party just so you don't pig out while you're there. That's the whole point of going to somebody's party, to eat their food for free. Do you remember college? It's kind of like that. Number six on the Darren Marlar holiday eating plan, never under any circumstances work out between Christmas and New Year's. No, save that for January when you've got nothing else better to do. Now is the time for those long naps, which you're going to need after circling the buffet 10,000 times with a big plate of food and a vat of eggnog. Number seven, if you come across something really great at the buffet table, like Christmas cookies in the shape and size of Santa, sit next to those. Position yourself near them and don't budge. Eat as many as you can before people start noticing you. And number eight, the same thing goes for pies. Eat as much as you can. Mince meat, pumpkin, uh, apple, uh, whatever. And always have three slices too, all right? Have one of each, pumpkin, mince meat, and apple. Now, if you don't like mince meat for some reason, have two pumpkin and one apple, or one apple and two pumpkin, or whatever. The fact is you need to have three slices of pie, period. I mean, really, when else during the year can you have more than one dessert? Certainly not Labor Day. So there you go. I hope these holiday eating tips will be a benefit to you. And from all of us here at the Marler household, have a very Merry Christmas. Time for some pumpkin pie. Three slices. <laughs>